Here we go, another reveals and stuff. Hello, I am everyone. personally I'm hoping of Dragon Ball Legends. Thank that you we for get an Ultra Majin Vegeta. Me, as but. Always. Hello, everyone. I'm Yuka from the Dragon Ball Legends there Global Marketing Team. Thanks for tuning in. The sagas from the movie Z campaign was held from the end of August up through early October. You it's tricked us. You're giving us a turlis. This campaign was largely focused on three movies. We Which I appreciate you for, but events related to them. It also featured a lot of first time characters for legends, such as Garrick Jr. and the Taras Crusher Corpse. Which was sick. released Ultra Rarity Turles. The Turles uh, 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 ironically, it was pretty cool. Great synergy when you put them together. And following it up with that Ultra Turles was awesome. Parties, that much more fun to play. Also, the Dragon Ball Daima anime has finally started airing in Japan. We're all looking forward to Yes, it to has, watching. and it was so good. And Goku Mini in the new series has already been released in Legends. The release was so fast that we bet a lot of you were quite surprised. This character is available for no, the summon, but you no can also get That's kind of what I expect. Z power from the login bonus and more. We hope you'll give this new Goku from Daima a try. We plan to release other Daima related <clears> events in Legends, oh, so yeah? be on the lookout. For our first segment today, we have Legends update info. This is the segment where we'll give you info about updates that are scheduled for November. New PvP mode, what? A new PvP mode is coming three for parties with three time. characters. Win with all we parties. We plan to make it a more simple, casual mode where you aim to get three wins using three parties. Okay. To quickly touch on the rules, players will have to make three different parties made up of three characters each. So and then bench. battle with each of those parties one at a time. Winning with all of your parties will allow you to earn a special prize, so you'll want to aim for three wins. It'll be important to create multiple parties that can take on a variety of opponents. If you lose a battle, you'll be able to rework your party and try again. Oh. However, characters that were used in parties that you already won with will be unavailable, oh, okay. so you'll need to plan accordingly. If each party is only catering to wells there, Toshi, are you? Then, unlike a normal six character party, You'll simply be picking the three characters to use in battle. That should make it a whole lot easier to come up with a good team. That's right. We hope you'll all be able to enjoy some fresh and exciting PvP okay. battles in this new mode. Interesting. While it will be around for a limited time only, this mode will be available alongside regular raiding matches, so it's similar to Legends Battle Royale, where there's simply an additional PvP mode. Okay. You'll still want to prep by powering up your characters and making sure that they each have proper equipments. Moving on to our next Speaking segment, of which, am I crazy for thinking that like... Info. This time, we'll start by reviewing the new characters. Alright, everyone. Please take it away. talk about it in a second. Alright. Check these out. Please. Please. Boo Han. I was about to say, it sounds like a boo. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Majin Buu good with Hercule assist. Wait. Are they redoing the spirit? They're redoing the spirit bomb. Okay, here we go. Okay, cool. Yeah, Hercule did so much. Alright, let's... Alright, 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 alright. So it is a Legends Limited right now. Here we go. I'm the strongest no way. It act we were right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nah. Dude, why are we just... Why are we pumping fusions like this? They are literally doing every fusion ever in the game. Okay. Man, you guys know how bad I wanted to Majin Majita. All right. LL. Super Saiyan 3 Goten. He technically doesn't have one. He's actually a new That's Legends right. Limited character. Coming straight from episode Majin Buu Saga Z, we have okay. Sparking, Majin Buu, Good, Hercule, Assist, and I just thought since it would, they were... Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. Well... I thought since they had a, the Hercule Assist, exciting. it made sense to me yep. that we we're going back to the, the final Spirit Bomb. This pair, so be sure to check but, them out. And we finally have a Legend first Limited ever Legends Limited Gotenks, so it's Thank like six and a half years in. Makes sense. In the trailer, but 
for the legendary finish, Gotenks turns the opponent into a volleyball, just like with Majin Buu in the original series. It's exactly the kind of funny, but still very cool move that you would expect from Gotenks, and we hope that everyone will enjoy it. Let's jump right into the abilities for Majin Buu Good, Hulker Assist. Not only the animations, okay. but the abilities are pretty distinctive too. Please check out this video. What does that mean? Actually, pretty impressive animation for Boo. That like, like tackle type Boo looking Girl animation Girl was. Is element yeah. yellow, and the Z ability three will buff episode Majin Boo Saga Z, and tech regeneration allies. While Boo's strongest features is its ability to support allies, it also has a pretty tricky fighting style, as you might expect from a tag team with Hakyo. Starting with those support abilities, this character excels at boosting the damage inflicted by allies. If Boo's health dips below a certain percentage upon receiving an enemy's attack, then allies will get a damage boost. And they will also get a damage boost when this character is returned to standby. Use Boo to buff up allies' damage inflicted, then switch to a character that specializes okay. in defense and go on the attack. In addition, Boo can easily return to standby and once on standby, return to the battlefield relatively quickly. Specifically, Boo can gain a buff that shorten own substitution counts when it uses strike or blast arts, and even shorten all substitution counts when returned to standby, so Boo is easy to switch out. Keep switching Boo in and out repeatedly to make full use of those support abilities that activate when returning to standby. Okay. Now for some of Boo's trickier abilities. Your opponent's Obscure hand will no. be obscured when you land a special move art. Where they can't see which card uh, is which, that will be your chance to go on the offense. Plus, if you I land an ultimate card, man. the enemy will be possibly switched out. He's like, it's not just an uncommon ability, it's powerful too. too. That. That's all for Boo. It's a character that excels at support, but also has some tricky abilities. We hope you'll give it a try. All right. Next up, we have Legend Limited Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Red. <laughs> what do we think? I just like that presumably it does the same thing where it uses someone on assist and there's no one there they'll use piccolo Super Saiyan 3 Goku Red. is we were right. Red. There you go. And the Z ability 3 will be episode Majin Buu Saga Z. Tag Hybrid Saiyan and Tag For Fusion this, Warrior. Although the turtles just came out as a blue Majin character, Buu Saga, so it's like Hybrid Saiyan and Fusion Warrior parties all received best during the 6th anniversary in the form of new characters. Gotenks Element has good affinity with Ultra Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and Legend Limited Ultimate Gohan, who are both Element Purple, so they will make powerful teammates as well. Gotenks has high what if I just got into the game today, though? Actually, Gogeta is live, wanted huh? to focus on the super awesome feel of Gotenks. As depicted in the original series, use this character's ability at the start of battle. Combining the effects that activate at battle start, Gotenks' arts card draw speed will increase by two levels for a set number of time accounts, and this character will even have a significant reduction to all arts costs. Attribute downgrades and abnormal conditions will also be nullified, meaning Ultra Golden Freezer, Blast Arts Cost Up Effect, and other nasty debuff in the current meta won't affect you. Ah. Not only that, but when Gotenks enter the battlefield, enemy special cover changes will be nullified for a time, so this character really does possess some overwhelming offensive abilities. Gotenks is particularly powerful during the initial stage of battle, but that doesn't mean this character is weak later on in the fight. After all, Gotenks has a unique gauge. It's an attack type unique gauge that charges whenever Gotenks uses Arnold's. 
Charging it fully can activate a variety of powerful offensive effects that can restore Gotenks key, draw a nuts card, boost damage, and more. Plus, it will be consumed when Gotenks returns to standby and activate a number of support effects for allies. It's important to be aware of the unique gauge as Not expended on miss. Lastly, let's discuss Gotenks unique and powerful special move and ultimate arts. The special move arts, Finish Flash, will nullify unfavorable element factors upon activation. That means you'll be able to deal big damage to powerful blue opponents as well. This move even has some random effects, namely a chance to reduce the enemy's Dragon Balls on hit, and also a chance to inflict faint. Special move damage gets a significant boost when the unique gauge is full as well, so you want to use special move odds as much as you can. Now for the ultimate odds, charging ultra boo, boo valuable. When this move is activated, all of the cards in your hand will be destroyed, and depending on the types of art destroyed, different ah, effects I will love activate. Faint so much. For example, when a special so art is ever. destroyed, Gotenks will get a big boost to critical weight. Be sure to memorize the effect that activate when each type of arts is destroyed. That's all we have to share about Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks abilities. But what did you think? We hope you'll give this unique and powerful character a try. He's okay. My two most sought after characters. Please check out the site in the description after the premiere. Give it a look if you're curious. We're in That's Ultra Majin Vegeta. Info we have for you today. But we still have more to share. Uh, or Next a Buhan. A, bu a Buhan Dabora. Dabra from episode Sorry, Majin Buu Saga Z is getting a Zenkai Awakening. The Zenkai ability will target characters that are both Element Blue and episode Majin Buu Saga Z. After Zenkai Awakening, Dabra will gain a number of support abilities, including the ability I saw, I to I want them to give us the Legend of the Buhan so bad. With special move arts and the main ability and even the ability to boost ally damage upon returning to standby. Longtime players will be familiar with this, but one of Dabra's held card is a special art, meaning you'll be able to draw tons of special art dealing battle. With the addition of more support abilities, Dabra will help you make even better use of characters that have powerful special arts, so we hope you'll try lots of different team formations. Do that. That Deborah that? art is actually really good. I never just like sit there and looked at it, but that art is awesome. A new unique equipment for Legends Limited Super Saiyan 3 ah. Goku is coming. This is Super Saiyan what? 3 Goku from the Majin Buu Saga. There's yeah, that's who I thought we were going to be seeing today. For this character, which makes this the second one. Correct. This time, the equipment will be available from the Ultimate Equipment Collection. So make sure to get the best piece you can for your Legends Limited Super Saiyan 3 Goku. That's all the info we have to share with you today. Dragon Ball Daima has kicked off, and Goku Mini has already joined the fight in Legends. The Daima-related excitement has only just begun in Legends. We hope you're all excited and ready to have some fun with it. Thank you for watching today. We hope you join us again in the next reviews and stuff. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. I hope you guys liked the video. Subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. You can click a video over there. Bye. Bye. <laughs>